Hi, it's uh, Tom and Al from Red Rose Wargaming. We're going to do another uh, card, card unveiling. unveiling. Uh, this time we're doing Seraphon, so uh, quite looking forward to this one. Yeah, though. yeah. Alabama yeah. Lizards. Alabama Lizards. If you know lizards, what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah. Uh, right, uh, let's bust them open. We have actually cracked them open, but we're, yeah. uh, we haven't took them out. It's because Dad's not good at Because I'm not very good at opening things. See? He's so not, not very good at opening things. My God. I will make Corey will be quite interested in these, won't he? Yeah, I'm interested in these. Yeah. Right, uh, okay, I think that's all. Should we take away the, uh, we'll take away the uh, foreign language ones? Yeah, yeah, oh, heck. One side. Oh, heck. I think that's Russian. Do you reckon? Yeah. Oh, I must have unpacked yeah, the front. On the... <laughs> Fire to time, it's Seraphon, yeah, right? That's the one, so, yeah. as usual, uh, we've got the... All, all the foreign language cards? Yep. Yeah. Right, so, in the different groups we have here, we have Pterodon Riders, Ripodactyl Riders, you like that one with Welsh did like that. out there, Skinks, <laughs> Soros Guard, Soros Knights, Alabama Lizards, Soros Warriors. Yep, uh, pretty standard. Yeah, it, well, quite, a big, quite, quite a big, quite a big range. Right, so we'll have a look at the abilities after. Yep. So you could start today, Thomas. Ooh. Hey, good old Skink. Uh, so this is just your. Uh, I'm assuming this is just a basic boy Skink. Eighty points is. Eighty-five points is actually. Eighty-five points yeah, yeah. seems quite a. Well, uh, never learned to read. <laughs> he's got uh, an ability. Don't know what it is. But we'll find out. We'll go for the. Shall, uh, we, shall we start? Yeah. All right. Come then. <laughs> uh, so I'm he's got just a, teaching him. Six inch move. Uh, toughness of three. Eight wounds, which doesn't really inspire confidence. Inspire confidence, but you know it's not. It's it's not bad. No. Uh, he's got a, a ranged attack, which is eight. Just eight, so there's no minimum range on it. That's cool. Uh, one attack with it, though. Yeah. Uh, th three strength. Uh, damage of one, four. He's also got a melee attack, which is one inch, three attacks, three strength, one, three. Well, we're quite interested to see what that special ability is, 85 isn't it? 85 points. 85. I think that's quite dear, right? I think it? that's quite dear. But he's got two abilities, though, hasn't he? You've got the potential of range, haven't you? That's one the attack. thing. Yeah, yeah. You just show him that one, yeah. Mm. Yeah, you got potential range. Interesting. Right. Interesting. Yeah. So the next one is another skink. Well, this one's less. This is only 65 points. Uh, he has, uh, again, a move of six, which is bloody fast. He's only got eight wounds. <laughs> he's, got, he's got a toughness of two. Well, they're like little... Yeah, yeah, they're little lizards, aren't they? He's got toughness two. Uh, he looks really angry, doesn't he? Well, you would be if you had yeah, toughness yeah. 2, wouldn't yeah, you? Yeah, he would. Oh, look at that, right? He's got a range of 12. He has two attacks. Strength 3. will do a 1-4 damage. He's got a blow dart. Yeah, yeah. I think that'd be more. I think so as well, yeah. Look yeah. at that. And then in close combat, it's, it's very similar to the other one. Range 1, 3 attacks. Strength 3, doing 1-3 damage. Yeah. Do you know what it is? I'd be more inclined to take a few of them. I, I would. But yeah. we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. That shooting attack's much better than the other one, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. Uh, next up, we have another... Why is he 85 points? I think he might be a lord. You reckon? But he's got the same... No, he's not got the same... No, it's wounds that generally show you, doesn't it? I just don't understand it. No. Right, anyway. Uh, so, this is uh, another skink. 60, 60 points. Uh, rate, uh, a speed of 6. Ah, he's not shooting three. Though, was he? Uh, oh, no. Toughness... Uh, not toughness. Uh, wounds of 8. Uh, and a special ability. I think it's going to be a skink ability. Uh, he's got a range of 1. Uh, three attacks, three strength, one three. Not bad for sixty points. No, pretty basic chaff. I'd, 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 I'd probably want more to the sixty-five point one. Yeah, personally. But again, we'll yeah. we'll look at the list after. Um, next, up. next one. There's Another the skink. Leader. Skink leader. Right, he's a hundred and thirty points. Again, movement six. Uh, Sixteen wounds. Toughness three. Uh, he's got the skink ability, which we're assuming is a skink ability and the leader ability. Um, he has uh, a range of one. He has four attacks. Strength three, doing two four damage. Not bad. Not but not from the points. Is not is it for a leader? Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, that's Next. pretty cool. Is that? Next up, uh, we're moving. Oh, we're moving out. Of, ooh, we're moving out a little skink territory into flying skink. Uh, so this is a pterodon rider. Uh, he's got a move of twelve, which is pretty fast. Yeah, yeah. Pre standard for flying, but mm. pretty fast. Uh, toughness three, not fantastic. Uh, 15 wounds. That's not all right. Bad. Not it's bad. All right. Uh, he's got the fly How keyword. How many points is it, uh, 170 points, right. sorry. Uh, he's got the fly keyword and another keyword, mm. which is flaming swords. Uh, two attacks, 
So he's got a three inch attack, uh, which is three attacks, uh, strength three, uh, one four, uh, and a melee attack, which is the bird, I'm assuming, uh, which is one inch, uh, three attacks, strength four, doing two four. So not bad. Not bad. Not fantastic, but not bad. It's not bad. For the, for the flying. And, and, well, yeah, flying. You know, giving you. 170 points for a flying character. Yeah. Right, this is another one of the uh, Pterodon, Pterodon Riders. This is a leader. Uh, he has three special abilities. Obviously, he has a leader special ability. He has a uh, move of 12. Yep. He has a toughness 3. Uh, 25 wounds. Not bad. Um, range 3 weapon. 4 dice. Strength 3. 2 4 damage. 230 points. Quite a lot, really, for that. Yeah. And then in close combat, he has uh, uh, range 1. 3 dice. Strength 4. 2 4 damage. So, obviously, he'd be using the. The three-inch attack with that one. Yeah. Well, uh, it's that strength four, isn't it? Yeah. Well, I, I guess it depends who you're, uh, who you're fighting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fighting something tough, you want more. Of course dice. you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, you, you want you want to eat it easy, don't you? Uh, oh, not bad. Uh, so next up we have a pterodon rider with a javelin. So this one under an eighty-five points. Uh, again, twelve-inch move, toughness of three, fifteen wounds. Uh, you've got the fly keyword, and I'm assuming that's the pterodon keyword. Is it a pterodon, that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Pterodon. Rip that, Ripodactyls. Ripodactyl, yeah, yeah. Different heads. I, I like the Ripodactyls. But we'll, we'll see how yeah, they yeah. are. Uh, this one has a, an 8-inch range on his javelin. Mm -hmm. Two attacks, strength three, and a 1-4. Uh, again, what, what the bite is one, one inch, three attacks... Strength four, two four. Which again is across the board in it. All yeah, the all the pterodons. Standard for the pterodons. Yeah. Themselves. Yeah. That's uh, not bad. Next up. So extra range is quite good for that one, isn't yeah. it? So he's just losing an attack, isn't he? And it's an extra fifteen points. Yeah. Right. So the next one is a Ripodactyl rider, and this is just a normal one. He's one hundred and seventy-five points. Are they, who rides them? Skinks. All right. Skinks ride all. Um. 175 points. He has a 10 inch move, so they're a bit slower than the other guys. They've got a 15 inch wound, uh, 15 inch wound, 15 wounds. Just ignore me. Uh, toughness four, which is better, obviously. Uh, they only have one attack though, and it's uh, range one, three attacks, strength four, two four damage. I guess the guy's too busy trying but, to ride it. Yeah, yeah, but he's got two four, uh, two special abilities, and he's tougher. And he's tougher. Well, they've all got two special abilities. Yeah, they've got a different one to the yeah. pterodons. Though. Yeah, that's quite interesting, is that? Uh, next up. We have right Ripodactyl boss. Uh, he's two hundred thirty-five points. Uh, ten inch move. Four uh, toughness. Four. <laughs> I don't know what I was going with then. Uh, Twenty-five wounds. So not bad. Uh, he's obviously got the fly keyword. Yeah. yeah. The Ripodactyl keyword and the boss keyword, which is standard. Uh, again, no attack from the skink. So uh, one attack. Four, four. No one inch attack. Four attacks. Strength four uh, and two four, which no, I didn't bad. It's not bad. It's just that obviously the other ones are getting double attacks, aren't they, for yeah. similar sort of points yeah. for you, aren't they? In fact, they're a bit less of the other ones, aren't they? So that's quite. It's a toughness four, I suppose. Is, is a selling point yeah. for them, isn't it? But it's more not. Wounds. It's not. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, they're not. Not, they don't not have less more wounds. wounds. No, they have the same. Oh, they've got wounds. the same wounds. Yeah, yeah. So the next one. Oh, I think that's. Is a Saurus, Saurus Guide? Guide. Saurus Guide. Quite nice models, them, aren't they? Yeah. I always do that, don't I? I was looking good. You know what a nice model that is. Right, they're 145 points. These have got a move of four. They have a toughness five, 15 wounds. 145 right. points is a bit, yeah. They do have a two inch reach, so two inch reach, three dice, strength four, doing two four damage. Not bad. And a special ability. And they have a special ability, I'm assuming which is that's quite going to be cool. a Saurus, Saurus Guard special yeah, ability. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seems to be going that yeah. way. Yeah. Uh, that's quite interesting, that actually. Yeah. He's got the halberd, though, hasn't he? He's got the halberd, shield. yeah, yeah. Uh, so this again, Saurus Guard, oh, but this is a big there? boss. Oof, nice. That's a nice, <laughs> that's a nice looking model. <laughs> 220, 220 points. Uh, he's got a four inch move, toughness of five, 25 wounds, uh, leader ability, and the I'm assuming it's the temple guard ability. It might even just be a Saurus ability. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, two inch, two inch range, four attacks, four wounds, two five. Not bad for two twenty. It's quite points. interesting that two inch range, though, isn't it? Hmm. I think it's because it got halberds. Yeah, yeah, I suppose. Yeah, halberds and shields. I'll leave them out so we can actually see what we're talking about when we get to the abilities. My God, we're still lost. Got a lot to go. Right, next one. This is uh, 
Saurus, is that a Saurus guard again? Warrior. No, it's not. Saurus no, Warrior. Saurus Warrior this is. Saurus Warrior. This lad is 75 points. Uh, he, has a, again, has a special ability, which looks like a Saurus special ability. Yeah. He has a move of four, which is average for them. He has a toughness four, so... Standard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, ten wounds. Ten wounds, so... But look at the points difference between him and a Saurus guard. Look at the points difference between him and the skin. Yeah, yeah. So he's got a one-inch range, three attacks, strength three, one three damage. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, I suppose strength he's not... Three. I suppose he's not thingy from... Uh, not much difference points wise from a, a skink, is he? No. And he's got uh, he's, he'll have a better toughness, better move. Uh, better toughness, better toughness, better wounds. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Uh, next up we have Saurus Guard with a spear. Uh, so 75 points again, so the same amount of points. Uh, movement 4, toughness 4, 10 wounds. So that's pretty standard so far. Uh, points in, Saurus, Saurus ability, I'm assuming. Uh, so with this one, you're going extra range so yeah. two inch range two attacks not great uh strength three again not great mm. by that point strength doesn't matter yeah uh and damage of one four so better damage better damage yeah yeah but, it's, but less, it's attacks. less attacks and okay. better range and better range yeah so that wouldn't be too bad if you take taking big blobs oh yeah you could take a serious horde army with this yeah, couldn't you yeah right next one i think that's the idea is, um this is the Saurus Warriors leader. Uh, he's 150 points. Uh, move of four, toughness four. He has 20 wounds. Uh, he has a one inch attack uh, with four dice. At strength three, do with two four damage. And he's got two special abilities. He's obviously got the leader ability and the, the uh, Saurus ability. So, eh, 150 just, points isn't I'm, bad. I'm just looking at him compared to the Skink. So for four more wounds. You're 20 points, aren't you? Yeah, but you're losing two two inch move. But, but you're yeah, getting four yeah. more wounds and one more toughness. So I guess it depends what you're going up against. Yeah, yeah, it depends um, what type of army you, you want to run. Yeah, anyway, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay. Here we have. Oh, uh, your Alabama lizards. The first of the Alabama lizards. 115 points, six inch move, toughness four, uh, 20 wounds. Obviously, he's got the mounted trait, so you mm -hmm. won't be doing any climbing. Yeah. Uh, he's got the Saurus guard ability. Yeah, I'm yeah. Assuming. Yeah, yeah. Uh, one inch. One inch range, three attacks, uh, strength three, uh, and one three. That is not good. Hmm. Why are they all so low strength? You think lizards would be strong? The other one as well is I thought they may have done a mount attack. A mount attack. Yeah. Odd. Odd. It's got six six inch move even even that bad because yeah. you normal so, so the, lizards. So yeah. the the cold one is giving him a two inch move and yeah. that's it and a it's couple more wounds because it's his sister. Well. Right, next one. This is another of the Saurus Knights. Uh, again, it's got the Mounted Keyword. It's got the Saurus Keyword, I think. Uh, key Ability, sorry, not Keyword. Uh, he's 115 points, exactly the same as the other chap. Uh, move of six, 20 wounds, toughness four. Uh, he's got um, two inch range, two attacks, strength three, doing one four. So he's got less... Attacks. Yeah, same as the other one. Yeah, same as the it's mounted. like fishing for crits, isn't it? Yeah, You'd be fishing for crits for them. But, but that's what I'm saying. But it's, it's got the two inch reach, all, which isn't bad. All you gain between them and the unmounted is ten wounds, mm. two inch move. Ten wounds isn't bad. It's a lot of points, for, and you but gain again, the mounted trait. The other one as well is you, you're struggling on terrain. Granted, there so, are a few terrain sets that aren't elevated, are they? Yeah, but uh, the final one is the. The boss for the Saurus Knights. See, that does look nice, does that? You can't say that looks like an Alabama lizard. If anybody listening from Alabama, I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> I, I mean no disrespect. Uh, right, okay. 195 points, 6 inch move, 4 toughness, 30 wounds. Obviously, he's got the mounted trait. I'm assuming he's meant to have the leader trait and they forgot it again. <sighs> Th that's just an assumption. Uh, so, oh, mounted okay, trait. Uh, the... The Saurus, I'm, you know, it's just assume assumption, but yeah, you know. I mean, it might not do. It might yeah. not have these. Uh, it does seem odd though. Uh, so he's got a one-inch attack, uh, four attacks, strength three, two four, uh, and for 195 points, I think he's meant to be a leader, mm. personally. Uh, and they're just the the extras. Just chuck them to. See one that I don't quite understand. If he is supposed to be a leader, yeah. Why is he 195? 
Well, your Saurus Guide is 220. Because he, the Saurus Guide better. He's got better strength, better attack. He's got better, better, better toughness, better toughness. Yeah, 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 yeah. The it cold one adds it. nothing. No, you thought... Uh, no. Right, we'll have a look at special abilities. Yeah. Jump up first. Right, so the first double is for... Is it for the Skinks? I do believe it is. It's for the Skinks. It's called Nimble Retreat. Hang on. Yeah, yeah. It's Sorry. for the skinks. Not the flying skinks, just the normal skinks. Uh, nimble retreat. Uh, a fighter can use this ability only if they are within one inch of an enemy fighter. This fighter makes a bonus disengage action. That is an that, escaping that. ability. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah I think goblins have got one very similar, haven't they? Yeah, it makes sense. Believe. They're all meant to be like cowardly, yeah. aren't they? Right, go on, then. I don't know if a skink's cowardly, but... Right, this is a, this is a leader little. ability. Uh, yeah, this is a leader ability on a double. Uh, Cold-blooded commander. Oh, this is uh, a fighter can use can use this ability only if an enemy fighter has been taken down by an attack action made this activation. This fighter makes a bonus move or a bonus attack. Pretty standard. Yeah, yeah, pretty yeah. standard. Yeah, it's it's again, it's got to be done with some of them, hasn't it? Right, uh, this it's one is for Ripidactyl. Ripidactyls, and it's a double, and it's called Voracious Appetite. Uh, pick a visible enemy fighter within one inch of this fighter and roll a number of dice. Equal to the value of this ability. For each one, uh, for each four, each one, my god, for each four, allocate one damage point to that fighter. So that's not the, bad. That's the, There's a few um, of them, got it? The There's a few yeah. of them, very similar. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so this is the triple. This is coming with the pterodons, uh, the solar pterodons. Oh no, it's not. It's the. Yeah, it is all the pterodons. Uh, this is a triple uh, rain meteoric, me meteoric barrage. barrage. Can't speak. Failing English. Uh, until the end of this fighter's activation, the next time this fighter finishes a move action while within one inch of an enemy fighter, pick a visible enemy fighter within one inch of this fighter, allocate a number of damage points equal to that value of this ability. I quite like that one. It's yeah. not a bad one, that. Yeah. Again, it's an extra attack, isn't it? I, I mean, you're potentially doing six. A free six. Yeah, yeah. Right, um, um, next is four... Saurus. This is for the Saurus, uh, oh, well, and it's a triple. All the Saurus have got this. It's called Turing Bite. Uh, add one to the value of this ability. No? I'll start again, shall I? <laughs> add the value of this ability to the damage points allocated by each hit or critical hit for the next attack action made by this fighter, this activation, that has a range characteristic of three or less. <sighs> Do you know what? It's quite nice, wasn't that? Yeah. yeah. And it's quite fitting, really, whether you know, where your lizards bite their heads off and stuff. Yeah. Uh, finally, this is a quad, this is uh, one that all of them can use, it's called Wrath of the Old Ones. Uh, until the end of the battle round, add half the value of this ability, rounding up, to the attacks and strength characteristic of attack actions made by this fighter that have a range characteristics of three or less. That's good. That's good. It's a quad though, isn't it? Yeah. It is a yeah, quad. Quad yeah, six, so an extra yeah. three attacks on a lot of these. Again, it's, it, it's, it sounds quite fluffy that for him, doesn't it? So, reading this abilities, if you've Watch this Sarcom sect uh, video we've done. If this comes out before or after, um, if the what the the abilities from the Sarcom sect chamber of I can't say it. Sacrosanct. Right. I can't say evocators, and you can't say sacrosanct. Yeah. 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 So some yeah. of the abilities are pretty similar. Yeah. Yeah. But it's like a generic yeah, ability yeah. across the board. And obviously, if you go in with um, Stormcast, you go in elite. If you go in with these guys, you're going to. Well, take I mean, potentially, from... potentially, you could take a lot. Yeah, or you could take a small amount, couldn't you? Yeah, yeah. But I think this is quite a good one to be able to do. I'd like to say it can do everything, but it's it's not an elite army, is it? No, it's definitely not. An it's elite not an elite army. armor. No. So you, you uh... but it doesn't need to be. No, it has enough choice that you can you you pick a spanner for every. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, right. So we'll do a list each. Yeah, and um, tell, we'll you show you. tell uh, anybody. You want to put your list on the, uh, yeah, the yeah. comments? It'd be quite interesting to see what people think about what they what they're going to take. Yeah. Because obviously you could have a, a full skink list, you could have a full Saurus list, my plan. <laughs> couldn't you? So Saurus yeah, so we'll go back to his. Yeah, we'll, we'll back. Cheers. Right. Um, so I've done my list again. Comes to the night. Not again. Uh, it comes to the nine ninety points. Uh, I've. I know we said it's more of like a horde army, but I've gone for less of a horde. Uh, so mine is pretty much predominantly flying units. So my leader is the uh, Ripidactyl boss, um, just because I really like the uh, 
voracious appetite ability. It's pretty cool, is that? Um, following on, I would take two Ripodactyls, because uh, I like them. Uh, two Pterodons with the uh, ball and chain. Uh, the ones that are 170. Uh, and finally, I would have one single skink. The one with the blow dart, which is 65 points. And I feel like I'd use him as my uh, my infiltrator. So if I did that, I'd probably get the chameleon skink. Cool. You know, just to make him look yeah, yeah, yeah. different. Yeah, yeah that's cool. Uh, so yeah, the, the idea of mine would be to abuse Fly. Pretty good. I, I, I think yeah, flies yeah, an awesome yeah. ability. Yeah. yeah. Mine is completely different than Thomas's. I am taking a horde one. I'd have ten skinks, the ones with the blood arts, because I think they're flipping cool. Sixty-five points. Yeah. Uh, I'd have the Soros Guard Leader. Temple yeah. Guard. Temple Guard Leader, and then maybe just a couple of normal uh, Soros Warriors. How many? Two. Two. Yeah. So that's ten, twelve, thirteen. 13 models, yeah. Can you do that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'd have one. So if I need to join them together, don't I? 650, 8, 70. Plus, no, no, I wouldn't be able to do that. No, no, no. I ain't got enough points. I'm gonna have to take more of my blood out once. <laughs> you have to. Um, I, don't think, I, th I think it just look really cool, loads of skink. Yeah. It's fluffy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Loads of skink. In fact, I probably, I might not even take a Saurus leader. No. I might take a skink leader. Just have a look, shed load of skinks. You need one box for it. Yeah. So it's uh, a cheap. Again, you could you could do you could do this. I mean, I'm not sure. Do, do the box sets for the Saurus? Do they come as both? I think they or do you have come to get as different? both. Yeah. They? Right. So potentially you could do that as a Saurus. The flying ones you could do that as flying ones. And the skinks. So the skinks. it is the the ability is there to do it in one box. Do it in one box if you're not bothered. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, obviously, if you, if you fancy doing lizard men, you just get your mates or whatever and just split a couple of boxes between you. Yeah, yeah. Well, like, when, when we do it... Yeah. Oh, no, no, because I'm going to get the chameleon skin. But Corey's... Corey, Corey, yeah. Our, our friend Corey, he's got lizards as well, so he'll be... Happy. Happy. So, we, you know, you, potentially, you, you, it doesn't have to be that expensive. No. It's, it's as expensive as you want it to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you go for, like, all... Yeah, if, if, if you want it to more, like, yeah. look custom. Yeah. Even the flyers, I don't think they'd be that expensive. I think you get no. three in a box. I don't know. So I'd need two boxes. Yeah. But, yeah, but it's, it's still, like, 60 quid, that one, isn't it? Yeah. 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 So, again, we're, we're, this is our, our thoughts and, and things. We will be quite curious to see what everybody else thinks, that, you know, say, yeah, uh, they're going to do it. Yeah. Won't we? Yeah. So uh, yeah, put in comments. You know what you what you do, what colours you go for, stuff like that, which would be quite interesting, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's nice to see what other people go for. It's always good to have a read of what people yeah, think of that. Definitely. So this is the end of this one. Thank you very much for watching. Yep. Please okay. like, subscribe, tell your mates, uh, leave a comment, leave a comment. Definitely uh, leave a comment because it's nice to hear from from everybody. Yeah, we've got. A, I think we've got an Instagram now. Oh yeah, we've got Instagram, really we've got a Facebook, works. yeah, we've got Facebook, uh, Twitter. Uh, Twitter. So any, again, you can contact us on any of them. Um, yeah, just just get in contact with, just like talking to folk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. again, we've all we've all got something in common, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, so yeah. thank you very much Cheers, for watching. Thank you. Bye -bye. See you next time.